Hello children, hope you all are fine and safe at home. The next topic in lesson number 1 is rounding of numbers. So let us see your house. Near your house, we have two shops, shop A and shop B. Shop A is 2 km away and shop B is 10 km away. My question is, which shop will you prefer to go? Shop A. Why? Because it is near to your house. And why not shop B? Because it is farther from your house. So what we conclude from the above discussion and from the above figure is nearer is better. Now the next topic is rounding to the nearest tens. Let us take an example of 28. We have two limits for your 28 that is 20 and 30. So 28 is it near to 20 or 30? It is nearer to your 30. So 28 can be rounded up to 30. Let's see some more example. Example is 113. As it is told to find out the rounding to the nearest tens, we have to find the range of that have a difference of 10. So the range is 110 to 120. Now we will use the concept of near. 113 is nearer to 110 and not 120. So 113 can be rounded to 110. Let's see the next topic. Near rounding to the nearest 100. In this one let us take an example of 168. As it was told to round it up to the nearest 100, so the range difference should be your 100. So the lowest limit is 100 and the upper limit is 200. So 168 is nearer to your 200, not your 100. So 168 can be rounded to 200. Let's see some more example. 2456. As it is told to find out to the rounding to the nearest hundreds, so the difference should be a hundred. So the range is 2400 to 2500. Next rule number 2, let us use the concept of near. So 2456 is nearer to 2500. So 2456 is rounded up to 2500. Now the next topic is rounding to the nearest thousand. Let's take an example. 12,850 as it is told to find out the number rounding to the nearest thousands the range difference should be a thousand so here the range is 12,000 to 13,000 so 12,850 will be nearer to 13,000 and not 12,000 so 12,850 is rounded up to your 13,000 Now let's go to the exercise 1.5. List all the numbers that can be rounded to the nearest 10. So we have to find it out all the numbers that can be rounded to the nearest 140 that is also 10's place. So the upper limit and lower limit, two limits are there for every number that can be rounded to the 10's or 100's or 1000's. So it is asked for 10's. So 140 have a lower limit of 135 to 139 and an upper limit of 141 to 144 that can be rounded to 140. Similarly, the other two, two and question number 3 and question number 4 can be done. Coming to question number B, round the following numbers the nearest to the 100. So we have to find a range of difference of 100. So 1289 is the question it can be rounded up to which number the range is 1200 to 1300 so 1289 is nearer to 1300 so 1289 is can be rounded up to 1300 similarly 535 have a range of 500 and 600 so it can be rounded up to 500 similarly question number three and four Coming to the next question, round list the numbers that can be rounded to the nearest 100. Again the same, same, the upper limit is there and a lower limit is there. So the question number A is, one is 1400, the upper limit is 1401 to 1449 and lower limit is 1350 to 1399 that can be converted or you can say rounded up to 1400. And the condition is nearest to 100's place. 
similarly we can do the question number 2 3 and 4 coming to the next question question number d round the following numbers to the nearest thousands the question number 1 is 13546 so it has to be told that it is to be rounded up to the nearest thousand so the difference should be your thousand so 13000 and 14000 so 13546 is equivalent to 14000 question number e list all the numbers which can be rounded to the nearest thousand question number 1 is 24000 again the lower limit here is 23500 to 23999 and the upper limit is 24001 to 24499 similarly we can do for question number 2 3 and 4 coming to the word sum f and g here nothing to be to be done as you do the sums we have done the previous sums only statement is to be added here so read the question first question number f now coming to the answer number of people saw a cricket match between india and australia if there were 5798 that number has to be rounded up to hundreds place so it is nearer to 5800 and similarly the question number g also Here you have the questions of exercise 1.5 previous in the previous video also I have uploaded all the questions you can refer that video also and here is the answers for all total answer for exercise 1.5 you can refer after doing it I hope you all will do exercise 1.5 and if you have any doubt leave a comment in the comment box like and share thank you bye and take care till we meet in the next class